If anybody knows what these things are, leave a comment. You see those? Trust me, I'm gonna show you some more. There's a crab. And then there's all of these like wiggly things. Someone said that uh, those, they don't know what it is, but supposedly it's dangerous. Supposedly. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not too sure. But yeah, pretty much just, uh, I'm at Sonor right now, and on a, oh my gosh, look at that one. So yeah, that's Sonor Beach, and just walked out to the sea to this, like, it's kind of like a, a island of sorts, but it's a, a island with all of these moving things in it. You gotta like really watch your step so you don't step on these wiggly creatures that are in the water. Yeah, there's there's not as much in these parts. That's my friend Aline over there. Oh, there's one. It's not moving. The stuff in the water just amazes me. It's so alive, you know. I need to get over here. Okay. It's like I'm walking on a, a living organism right now. That's what it feels like. What do you think of this place, Aline? Oh, don't put your foot on it. You don't want to startle it. Whoa, look at that. Check this one out. What do you think it is? Do you know? So cool. I need to take a picture of that. Alright, time to get my cell phone out and take myself out of the moment for a second. Like we're on an alien planet. Uh, be careful, it might 
jump. My jump out. Do you guys think that that can jump? It looks like it. Let's look and see if we can find other stuff. I want to keep you guys happy and I know that uh, had to be somewhat entertaining for you guys to keep keep watching the video so we'll like look at other things. I could look at that thing like all day though. I've never seen like a a living organism like that. Look how far this goes, Alan. Look how far it goes. Look, pretty much all the rocks here are just very interesting, too. Wow. Probably like little kids if they find those things that we just seen they'd probably be torturing it I've seen some like pretty weird stuff that the locals do with some of these things not all the locals are like that but like, you know how kids are wanting to poke around at things I was one of those kids at one point I uh, took a bunch of tadpoles and collected them inside of a bucket, like hundreds. And me and my friends just threw them out of a, the back of a truck and thought it'd be really fun. Looking back, it's like I, I definitely would not do that again. I just realized I don't make that much eye contact with the camera. I'm going to start doing that for you guys so it can be a little bit more intimate. I know y'all want intimacy even if you aren't going to say it. Gosh, this is amazing. I, I love being out in the sea. I just want to take a boat and just go and live out there for like maybe eight hours or maybe a day at the most and then come back. I'm pretty attached to the land. Oh my gosh. Look at that. It feels like a living creature. <laughs> Alan, look at this. You can touch it. Yeah, look at this rock. It's like really green and like spongy, kind of firm. You want to touch it? What do you think? Walk in this and see if we can see anything cool. What? Wow, it 
feels weird walking on all this. We can walk that way. plant is edible. take a picture of that it looks like a rainbow that's too good not to get a photo of Look at that. Kinda wanna keep this. Maybe. Okay, I hear like popping sounds all around us. Like there's like some animals that are aware of our presence. It's probably maybe crabs or something. Yeah, I think we're probably gonna head back. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and me rambling through it. Make sure to subscribe to my channel for more content. And I will see you all next time. Much love, guys. Peace.